For the calculation, pressure at 3 bar and 30 liter per minute, calculate the mass transfer coefficient K. So, diameter for jacketed absorption column is 32 mm. So, area of sphere is pi d squared over 4. We got 8.04 times 10 power of negative 4 meter square. So, velocity is equal to Q over A. Q is 10 for gas flow rate which is 30 liter per minute divided by area. So, we got 0 0.6219 meter per second. We find the average temperature at 34. So, we got the temperature is 29.4 degrees Celsius. Uh, to find the density and viscosity, we use the appendix A33. So, after we got the density and viscosity, we can find the Renault number. So, Renault number is equal to diameter times velocity times density divided by viscosity. So, we got the answer is 1251.82. Next, we uh, find the DAB and porosity uh, to calculate the Schmidt number. So, from uh, table 3, we got from the website or and journal also. So, adsorbent is CMS because uh, this experiment used adsorbent CMS, carbon molecular sieve and absorbent uh, for this experiment is oxygen so diffusion rate constant is 0 0.024 so table 2 is uh, to find the void fraction void fraction uh, for absorbent CMS is 0 0.255 so we can find the Schmidt number so Schmidt number is 6.6239 times 10 power of negative 4 so, to find the K prime C, we need to find first JD. So, JD, uh, we use uh, from the mass transfer to pack back, gases in pack back of sphere. So, JD equal to 0 0.4548 divided by white fraction times Renault number, power of negative 0 0.4069. So, we got 0 0.098. So, from there, we are uh, from... Uh, after we get the JD, so we can find the K prime C. Uh, use the formula equation seven point three point five. So JD equal to K prime C over velocity times Schmidt number, uh, power of two over three. So K prime C is. 8.0205 meter per second. So we assume K prime C is equal to KC. Next. At pressure 2 bar and 40 liter per minute, we find the velocity, uh, new velocity, so V equal to Q over A. So we got 0 0.8292 meter per second. So area is still the same, 8.04 times 10 power of negative 4 meter square. So we find the new average temperature at DT4 which is 30.03 degrees celsius and to find the density and viscosity also we use the appendix A33 we interpolate uh, the temperature so we can find the Renault number dv rho over mu so we got 1660.17 so we have to find also Schmidt number, so we got 6.6595 times 10 power of negative 4. So we find also JD to get the K prime C. The formula is still same like uh, 3 bar and 30 liter per minute. So K prime C is 9.4598 meter per second. For the graph, we need to plot a breakthrough curve of C divided CO versus time and determine the TB from the both curve. For reading at 30 liter per minute and 3 bar, we need to plot a graph concentration ratio C divided CO versus time. For the concentration ratio, C average divided CO average, C average is represents for OT4 which is outlet oxygen concentration in percents while CO is represents for inlet oxygen concentration OT3 
So we need to divide OT4 divided by OT3 to get the y axis and the to plot the graph. To find the OT4 and OT3 average, we need to plus the reading 1, reading 2 and reading 3 and divide it by 3. For example, reading 1 at 10 seconds at the column OT4 is 0. Reading 2 at column 10 seconds OT4 is 0. So reading 3 at 10 seconds for OT4 column is also 0. 0 plus 0 plus 0 divided by 3. So we get the 0. So we need to calculate uh, like this for every time until 120 seconds. Next, we need to find the TB. To find the TB is TB minus T1 divided by T2 minus T1 equal to C divided by CO. So we can calculate the TB is 12. So we get TB for 30 liter per minute and 3 bar 12.38 seconds. C divided CO is equal to 0 0.05 because we got this value from the lab manual of experiment. So they said the breakpoint concentration CB represents the maximum allowable concentration of the outlet fluid and it is often taken as a relative concentration C divided CO of between 0 0.01 to 0 0.05. So we assume CB is equal to 0 0.05. So CO we got from our average uh, table. So CO is for T, C2 is 0 0.21. So we can calculate the TB 12.8 seconds. For the reading at 40 liter per minute and 2 bar, we also use the same method like before to find the concentration ratio C average divided CO average also and versus time. And then um, after that we find TB. So TB is equal to 12.63 seconds. For the conclusion, adsorbent is the absorbing component which is oxygen, while adsorbent is the solid take up the gas which is the carbon molecule safe. When the time increases, the outlet oxygen concentration remain constant at 8.8% for both fluoride and precious, which is 40 liter per minute at 2 bar and 30 liter per minute at 3 bar. Mass transfer coefficient K was calculated at pressure 3 bar was 8.0205 meter per second and pressure at 2 bar was 9.4598 meter per second. When the pressure decreases, the K is increased. There are some uh, recommendations for this experiment. When we run the experiment, uh, some fuel need to be avoided to the near experiment place that can occur explosive when the oxygen combine with it. So lastly, um, we need to put uh, the proper international sign and symbol for hazard management. Uh, on the compressed oxygen containers. That's all from our group. That's all. Thank you.